What is up, guys? Floodmind14. Continuing from last episode, where we had a uh, started a duel against Kaiba, and we are going to uh, we just ended our turn. Kaiba just uh, dust tornadoed our mirror force, unfortunately. So that sucks. But uh, anyway, continuing on. Been a kind of a back and forth duel. Uh, yeah. Last time he was able to uh, get out X Y Dragon Cannon and destroy our different dimension capsule, which unfortunately I searched for a uh, blackluster soldier, so that kind of, that's unfortunate, but uh, uh, let's see, so he's got Wicked Worm Beast, now Wicked Worm Beast is going to return to his hand, so let's actually get a, uh, <laughs> let's get White Magical Hat here, let's go with the counterplay, let's go with the counterplay here, well I guess I already did have a uh, Spirit Reaper on the field, but uh, yeah, return that to your hand, Kai. All right, I draw. Knight Assailant is good. Uh, let's go ahead and do White Magical Hat. Uh, should I do uh, Sinister Serpent Attack? Um, probably not. I can be more disciplined than that. Let's not do it. White Magical Hat Attack. Get rid of that Wicked Worm Beast, son. tornado this one. I just gotta... Oh, wait. No, I don't have this tornado. I have ultimate offering. Whoops. I was gonna already say, I got a bad feeling about that last face down, but, uh... We'll see if I was right, guys. We'll see if I was right. I got a bad feeling. Mirror Force? Which you got? Oh. Okay, Kaiba. But... <laughs> yeah, so, uh, last episode, he also... He, like... This is definitely, like, his beginner deck, because he's got, like, Wicked Worm Bees. Last episode, he played a m Machine Conversion Factory of all cards. I was just like, what? Like, yeah, so this definitely isn't, uh, let's set Shrink here. This definitely is not Kaiba's, uh, final version of the perfected deck, let's say. Oh, with Shrink, I, we should have this one wrapped up, honestly. That's fine. What are you gonna do with that? Uh, Z-Metal Tank. That's a good call. That's a good call. Damage step, damage step. Yes. I activate my shrink card, Kaiba. Uh, let me make sure I hit the right monster here. Max View, designate one monster, yeah. Definitely don't want to target my own spirit reaper, that would suck. That would suck. Alright, Kaiba, take your damage, son. So he's down to 600. Alright. So I think we can get exactly zero, actually, if, uh... Sinister Serpent, and... Oh, now I draw a Morphing Jar. Well, that's fine. This duel's over. Uh, maybe I should set Morphing Jar, though. So I think I'll get the all Monster Card bonus. You know, as long as... Assuming this works, you know. Assuming everything goes through, which, I mean, it should. Last turn, he didn't play Space Downs either, so yeah. Why wouldn't it work here? Alright. And Spirit Reaper, finish him off. Sickle Scythe. Awesome. And with that, we win. Alright, that was quite an interesting duel. Right? You win. 102 experience. Man, that's good experience. Yeah, exactly zero, and that's it. Alright, Kaiba, we win. What do you have to say for yourself? <laughs> this victory's interesting to you, Flynn. Alright, no shadow games last night. Oh, that's good. Well, actually, it's not good. I kind of wanted to run into one. Because there are some new Shadow Game uh, duelists on the other side of the map, but, uh, yeah, that's okay. Anyways, now that we're back here at home, let's check the mail. And, uh, no new mail, okay. Well, let's go to sleep. And, um, I'm actually going to change decks to start the day. There we go. Sleepy time. It's morning. Yes, it is. All right. So, let's go here. Uh, and I'm not sure if I saved the Luster Soldier deck, the changes I made. So let's save recipe, let's save the Luster Soldier. And this is how you change the decks in this game, by the way. So you go to here, read recipe, and then you can uh, kind of go down. We'll select, 
F I M A L message. Let's do it. All right. There we go. All right. Let's save and let's head out. Let's see if we can get the uh, the Destiny Ward combo going. Get a new bonus. All right. And I haven't really tested this deck yet. So really, to test this. Let's just duel someone on this side of the map, much like we did with Mako and the Power of Unity. Uh, let's see, who's here? Who is here? Yugi boy, regular Yugi. Alright, who else? Who else is here? Anyone new? Oh, there's someone new right there that I haven't registered. Uh, who's here? Uh, Grandpa, what? Grandpa's here in the morning? That's odd. I probably shouldn't test out my deck against Grandpa, though. Well, maybe I should. He doesn't have too much spell and trap removal. Uh, man. Oh, yeah, let's test it out against Grandpa, actually. Exodia versus Final Final uh, Destiny War deck. I like that. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it, Grandpa. Let's do it. I hear you're making quite a name for yourself, but the only way to know how good you really are is to do me. Let's do it. Yeah, let's do it, Grandpa. Yeah, final message. Alright. So, obviously, the strategy with this deck, you definitely want to draw a Destiny board first turn if you can. And if you can't, you definitely want to search it out first turn. So, let's see what we get. Hmm. Kind of a bad hand, not gonna lie. Alright, let's see what you do, Grandpa. Luckily, we do have Giant Germ. <laughs> As all, It seems like Giant Germ's like... I've said this in another episode. It seems like that card's like glued to my hand. Oh, Well, we drew another one. Speaking of glued to my hand, I did not want to draw another one. Uh, I guess let's set a Solemn and a Magic Jammer. These are here, obviously, to protect the Destiny board once I have it going. But anyway... Let's see, that sucks, so we can't summon next turn. Alright, warn him. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm not gonna solemn judgment that, are you kidding me? I'm not gonna solemn judgment that either, that would be kind of a waste. doesn't have the strongest monsters out here, so I'm not too worried about that. Alright, and next turn, as long as we don't draw like a Destiny board piece, we should be in good shape, honestly. Let's see what we get. Uh, last wheel. That is good, but unfortunately, yeah, I can't summon this turn, so... Mm. Looks like you got me for now, Grandpa. You're gonna get some dark attacks here, buddy. I actually have to play last wheel and search for like, I don't know, like Spirit Reef or something. Whoa, Fire Wing Pegasus. Mm. That does suck, but I'm not going to solemn, solemn that either. That does indeed suck. Pretty powerful monster there. It's got 2250. We used this earlier in our deck. Fire Wing Pegasus, meet your wing. Remember that, guys? Oh man, good times. Garuda Bomb! <laughs> Alright. Uh, Dark Spirit of the Silent. <laughs> Interesting. Yeah, I actually threw this in the deck, too. Another Bakura card. Uh, but believe it or not here, I'm gonna summon Giant Germ. I'm gonna throw it into Pyramid Turtle. I'm pretty sure I've got Spirit Reaper in this deck. I mean, I'm like 99% sure, so let's do this. Let's throw it in. And let's use Last Wheel to get something good from my deck. Just in case we can't get the Destiny board combo going. 
Uh, yeah, there's Spirit Reaper. Wait, I only have one in this thing? No, 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 I do have two. Alright, Spirit Reaper is a fit smoke. That'll do. That'll do. And I guess I end my turn with that, Grandpa. Let's see if you can get rid of a Spirit Reaper. Even if you can't, I got Solemn Judgment to protect us. Alright, so he's gonna gain life points. That's fine, go ahead. Alright. Stealth Bird. Now, I don't have, uh, I did throw in, uh, kind of a stall. Well, actually, I could get away with playing this card, honestly. Let's set it. Let's set it. Because I do have, uh, Dark Spirit of the Silent face down. So, believe it or not, I could get away with playing, uh, <laughs> Stealth Bird, believe it or not. No, not gonna solve that. Go ahead, go ahead. Uh, what do you declare battle with? Uh, oh, he did declare battle with uh, Firewing Pegasus. Interesting. Well, we'll play Dark Spirit of the Silent here. Yeah, so it'll cancel that. And now you'll be forced to attack me with something else. Ah, alright. There you go. And now you can't attack with this Pegasus. Draw. That's a pretty good draw right now. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. Lightning Vortex. Yes, yeah, so I'll gladly discard a solemn for that. Say goodbye to all your monsters, Grandpa. <laughs> Alright, that's exactly what we needed. Uh, let's. Uh, let me check the max view here. Yeah, let's switch this to attack mode. Let's, I know we're low on life, but let's also switch Spirit, Spirit Reaper. Definitely want to get rid of the last card in his hand, because as you know, he's going for Exodia. We're going for Destiny Board, so... Definitely want to get rid of whatever he's got in his hand on there. What you got? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Good move, good move. Alright. And what time are we at? Yeah, about 12 minutes, alright. Main phase two, let's switch Stealth Bird back face down. This card's so good. And we'll end our turn. It's got 1700 defense too. Man, very good card. What you got? Face down? Alright. Alright, now we can start doing some damage. Ooh! <laughs> Ooh, we got a good draw there. Alright, so I happen to, and this is exactly what I was talking about a couple episodes ago. Yeah, we happen to have all three uh, giant germ in our graveyard, so we banish them all. Yeah, this is exactly what I was talking about. Dark Necrofear is so easy to get out. And uh, let me make sure I'm doing the right thing here. Our special summon? Now, let me show my best spots to the Dark Necrofear. <laughs> and I'll flip some in Stellar Bird once again. Do that extra thousand. Good shape here. All right, and now battle phase time. Let's just attack. See what happens. Dark Nipple Fear attack is like voice different. <laughs> Dark Sphere of Destruction. <laughs> That's so awesome. I can't believe uh, we got Dark Necrofear on first door. Doesn't look like we're gonna get Destiny Board in the store, uh, mainly because we didn't draw it early. Also throw in like three uh, Cat of the Old Omen, just to search Destiny Board in this deck. Doesn't look like we got it, uh, you know, early uh, in this duel, so doesn't look like we're gonna get the bonus, but we will try for the bonus at, uh, in the next duel, so there's that. All right, Grandpa, you better have something face down now, because uh, I flipped someone's Stealth Bird again. Nope, not gonna solve my own card. That would be foolish. There we go, another thousand. All right, and I guess let's try for exactly zero. Switch Spirit Reaper to attack. Yeah, don't even need to play Graceful Charity, I don't think. Dark Necrofear attack. Dark Sphere of Destruction. <laughs> All right, and man, that Lightning Vortex really helped us out. That was hard in the cards right there. Sickle Scythe. All right, just like that, we win. All right, and we're at about 14 minutes. I think we can go for another one. I think we can go for another duel today. All right, and 86 experience. Yeah, Grandpa gave us pretty good experience, so. Always a good idea to duel him. 
Wait a day, he'll make a green rifle for you. Thank you, Grandpa, thank you. All right. Yeah, that duck, uh, it didn't take us a while to get control of the duel there. But, uh, yeah, we were eventually able to. Got Grandpa again there. I might fight him again, I don't know. Let's see who else we find here. We got someone new there. Uh, is that really it? I guess that's it. Weird. Well, I guess we'll take on whoever this is. Let's see. Oh, Mako. Uh-oh. All right. Yeah, Mako's... I don't know. Mako's got a pretty strong deck. And also, from what I remember, he does have MST. Does he have Heavy Storm? I'm not sure about Heavy Storm, but I do remember him having Mystical Space Typhoon. <laughs> Which is crazy, considering how early you can fight him. But let's see if we can pull off Destiny Board this time. That's a weird first turn. Wait, wait, wait. Deja vu, guys. I've seen this before. Sinister Serpent in attack mode. Is that is that Torrential Tribute face down? Show me the Torrential Tribute. Show me. Ah, interesting. All right, well, we do have last wheel in case this turn goes sour. Uh, let's set Grave Robber face down. Battle face. Yeah, let's attack with Exarion Universe. Ah, Raigeki Break. Okay, okay. All right, so not quite uh, torrential, but you know, basically did the same thing. Oh, he discarded Graceful Charity for that. Heck yeah, I'll take that. Um, I guess main phase two. Let's last wheel. Let's get the germs out of our deck in case we draw a Dark Necrophere again. Let's uh, yeah, last wheel. Yeah. And also, we have a uh, Crush Card Virus, so definitely a good idea to do this. So, Defense Mode. There we go. And let's set this. And he got rid of most of the cards in his hand. Well, he got rid of one. So let's, let's play Delinquent Duo. Let's play Delinquent Duo here. Let's see what we get rid of. Uh, what did we get rid of there? Manju, that's good. Oh, and we got rid of Pot of Greed. Man, why didn't you play all this first turn? Pot of Greed, Graceful Charity? Well, like, what's the matter with it? Why didn't you summon Manju first turn? What? What are you doing, Mako? What? Jeez. Man, you, you are messing up hard, bro. All right, so he's going to search with Manju. That's fine. That's fine. Get your ritual card. That's fine. Already. I guess I should have summoned Giant German Attack Mode. I don't know what I was thinking on that one. Well, I, I, was, I guess I was thinking I wanted to search, yeah. Alright, so take that damage, Miko, and we'll get two more germ. There we go. Alright. Manju coming in. Uh. Well, we know he has Fortress Well Oath. No, you know what? I'm not going to deck Devastation Virus yet. I'm not going to Crush Card Bullet Virus yet. Normally I would, but like, what if uh, the last card in his hand is like a card he can set face down? Because then I wouldn't have any monsters next turn. So, yeah, let's just see what he does. Main Phase 2. Okay, okay. That's fine. Jinzo! Interesting, interesting. Well, this is Grave Rubber, right? So yeah, let's play Grave Rubber first. Take his pot of greed. There we go. Just let me take a card from your graveyard, Mako. I choose pot of greed. Now I'm going to activate it. Voice crack for the win. All right. Ooh, we got sip. Perfect. We got Destiny Board. Okay, perfect, perfect. Okay, so... Hmm. Now, of course, I want to win through Destiny Board. We also got Jinzo. We got Lightning Vortex. Okay. We got Crush Card Face Down. All right. Now, normally I would play Jinzo. I mean, right, that's, the, that's what you would think I would normally do. But I'm actually just gonna... I'm gonna set Sinister Serpent. I'm gonna have Giant Germ attack his Serpent. 
Right. Next turn, I'll play Crush Card Virus to clear the field. And then we'll start with Destiny Board. Let's see if we can get it off. Let's see if we can get Destiny Board off. Yeah. So that's... Yeah. Normally, I would just go into Genzo there, but we've got Lightning Vortex in case things go uh, go sour. So let's just do this. Let's just do this. Let's, let's just try. Oh, he's going to tribute some. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, now... Now we play Crush Card Virus. Yes. I will use right here, right? Yeah, Crush Card Virus. There we go. Perfect. That's kind of exactly what I wanted him to do. I wanted him to tribute someone there. Yeah, let's see his hand. Let's see. So we know he's got the ritual. And we got rid of Giant Red Sea Snake. Very good. Very good. All right. So now we know he can't stop Destiny Board right now. He doesn't have MST right now, so that's good. Oh... Look at that art. Oh, man, that was so loud. Sorry about that if you're a headphone user, but pretty epic. Pretty epic animation there. Oh, my God. This is awesome. Okay. Yeah, let's try to win with a Destiny board. Let's try it. Let's try it. All right, I draw. Solemn Judgment. Now, I don't think I'll set Solemn Judgment yet. Maybe I should. Maybe I should. Now, let's keep it in hand for Lightning Vortex. Uh, but I will end my turn with that. Let's see if you can stop my Destiny board, Mako. Yes, we got another card with Crush Card. This is going good. This is going very good. This is like exact, almost exactly what I want this deck to do. It's just, you know, kind of use uh, Crush Card and some other powerful cards to stall out and just Destiny board. This is going good. This is going good. All right, turn two on a Crush Card. Okay, Smashing Ground. That's good. Uh, let's end the turn. We know all he's got Sinister Serpent face down, so we're looking good. Steel Shell, that's not going to help you at all. Alright. Alright, good, good. Another turn on this board. Alright, we got A. We got A. A. Alright, all we need is one more turn, Mako. Alright, that's the last turn on Crush Card. Uh, Spirit Reaper, very good. Very good to have here. So even if he gets rid of Destiny Board somehow, we still got the Spirit Reaper Freeze Down. All right, let's see if we can do it, guys. Let's see if we can get uh, the Destiny Board. So it's going to tribute. So we, so we know he can't stop us. We know he can't stop us because uh, the new card he got was Legendary Fisherman. Yes, Steel Shield, that's that's good and all, but it's not really going to help you, Mako. I, I don't need to destroy your life points. I don't need to because we've got Destiny Board. All right. And with that... The duel's over, guys. Go Destiny Board! Oh, awesome, awesome. I'm glad we got to show it. I'm glad we got it, got it, got it out this episode. All right, guys, let's see the animation. Let's see it. Oh, man, that is epic. And you, oh, it even makes the, the Shadow Game sound effect. Oh, that is so cool. That is so cool. And we, we resolved Destiny Board for the first time. F-I-N-A-L, yeah. And as you see there, you get a wow, you get a hundred for the Destiny Board finish bonus. Okay, now most gimmick decks, like, I wouldn't save, like, I wouldn't, but honestly, a hundred extra duel points per duel, that's kind of worth it. Like, this deck might be might be worth it just to run like against regular opponents. Are you kidding me? A hundred extra? Ha! No, I lost my fight with the honor my father instilled in me. I will win next time, Flood. Wow. A hundred extra and we get the 50 for the new bonus. That is awesome. Man, I love how it makes the shadow game sound effect too. Like, all oh, the Chucky doll sound effect. Like when you resolve, that's awesome. That's awesome. Wow, what a great episode. What a great episode. I wasn't sure we would finish in time, but we did, and we got we got it all on recording, man. Oh, man, awesome. Okay, guys, well, with that, um, definitely going to save. That was interesting. Definitely going to save to that. And, um, yeah, guys, that's going to be, yeah, 100 extra points for resolving Destiny Board. That might be worth it just to keep that uh, deck um, against some of the, you know, early game opponents. Uh, you know, early morning opponents. I mean, because 100 extra Kybercore points, that's that's quite a lot, yeah. Um, that's basically almost a whole pack, you know, by itself. Um, but yeah, I want to thank you guys for joining me. Hope you're excited about the new deck and uh, about this episode. 
but yeah, that's gonna be it. Um, so thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys all next time. Have a good day. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you're enjoying these. All right. Bye-bye.